So th this series of videos is on Morozzo's Sword and Rotella. This is a draft uh, copy of the 12 chapters that he lays out. I'm dividing this into three parts. First one decade, the first four chapters, which are short sequences of actions. Uh, and I will do a one final one that incorporates all 12 of them in sequence. Uh, there's a lot going on here, so I'm gonna try and talk each part out uh, so that it's slowly and I'll do it a bit more fluidly to uh, pull it together. So first of all we're starting with our left foot slightly in front of our right, Rotella by our left side, sword also on the left side. We're going to transition to Corona Strata, stepping over here, then we're going to thrust, give us the gun with the left foot, and then a mandrito with our right foot, making sure that we're in the iron gate. We're going to bring our right foot back to our left, and then step forward on the left, bringing us to Corunga Alta. So we are now in distance uh, in this sequence of actions, and we're dealing with a cut or a thrust from here. Regardless of what it is, I'm going to step to there inside, falso dritto, reverso to the leg, and then give what's called a reverso spinto to the right side, which is a kind of essentially a push cut uh, to the right side of the body. Uh, what I'm hitting really depends on what's available. Uh, he will specify sometimes lower or higher, like hit the head, hit the leg, uh, but generally it just says hit the right side. So that brings us to back to Kudu Alta. Next one is assuming that my partner is an iron gate. If that is the case, I will step with my right foot towards the right, thrust into the face. As they defend, my rotel is coming in. I'm going to cut to the thigh with a mandrito. And then we're going to throw our left leg back and do another one of those reverso spinto. Now we're in Corona Strata. Now here's an interesting play where I, I think it's fairly clear based on his description that this is, uh, there's a mistake because he has us moving the left foot three times in a row, which we know that we cannot do. Uh, based on what we know from previous material, that I will end lunch and the like, it likely looks something like this. So we're in Corona Strata. We're going to thrust over the rotella with a stoccata as the defender. We're going to pop a punta in falso over top so I can get behind the rotella. And this is going to be, I'm going to treat this as being my feint with the mandrito because anytime I do this, I can always turn that into a low cut, low or high. So I'm here. If they start going for that, we can throw a Rivenoso to the thigh, and then we're going to leave by throwing one more Rivenoso Spindo. So, all together, from the top, we have one, two, three, four, five. Now we're in distance. Attack comes in, Falso Drito, Rivenoso to leg, Rivenoso stepping back. If they are in Iron Gate, thrust, interject with the Rotella, cut a leg, step to Corona Strata, and our final one that we just did, thrust over their sword, use the Pontin Falso, imagine we're going to do that, cut a leg instead, and then the Reverso Spinto, bringing us back to Corona Alta. So those are the first four plays. Uh, next video will be the next the next four.